Imagine organizing your room without any shelves or drawers. Sounds chaotic, right? That's kind of how your brain would work without schemas, its personal filing system for understanding the world. What exactly is a schema? Think of it like a mental template, a pre-built picture of things you've encountered before. When you see a dog, your dog schema kicks in, filling in the blanks, furry, wags its tail, and barks. Schemas help you make sense of new information quickly and efficiently without starting from scratch each time. Why are schemas so useful? Imagine seeing a new restaurant for the first time. You wouldn't need to analyze every detail like the tables and chairs to know it's a restaurant. Your restaurant schema would tell you they serve food, you order from a menu, and you pay after eating. Schemas save you time and mental energy, letting you focus on the unique aspects of the new experience. Different types of schemas. Think of your brain's filing system as having separate folders for different things. You have schemas for objects, cars, houses, food, anything you can interact with, events, going to school, playing sports, attending a party, what happens and how it unfolds, people, teachers, friends, family, their roles, personalities, and how you interact with them, roles, doctor, athlete, student, what someone does and how they behave, self, your own likes, dislikes, skills, and experiences, your unique place in the world. How do schemas develop? Think back to when you were little. Your first dog schema might have been based on seeing pictures or meeting one friendly pup. As you encounter more dogs, your schema gets updated. You learn that some bark loudly, some are small, and some chase squirrels. Schemas constantly evolve with new experiences. The ups and downs of schemas. Schemas are powerful, but they can sometimes lead to shortcuts and biases. You might have a teacher schema that expects them to be strict, which could make you nervous around a more laid-back instructor. This is where critical thinking comes in, questioning your initial assumptions and being open to new information. Remember, schemas are your brain's way of organizing the world. They help you understand new things quickly and efficiently. Different types of schemas exist for different things. They develop and change based on your experiences. Be aware of potential biases and use critical thinking.